Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you are ready because I'm about to show you a little something something about Paladinos. Alright, just kidding. Uh, ladies and gents, I'm here with my lovely uh, wife Kaz, and of course we also have our dear friend, the Smoochster, Smoochie. She's right here, say hello. Hi, hi. Okay, so she'll be assisting me in doing a demonstration match, but what I'm going to show you first and foremost is Victor. Okay, Victor in 2022 is still one of the strongest damage dealers. He is very good at what he does. If you guys do not know what Victor does, he has an assault rifle that basically can have a burst fire mode or be automatic depending on the talent you take. Um, his, he can aim down sights, okay? The controls will be as shown per, as per your controller or keyboard. He can run and sprint, which is very useful if you're a COD player like me, and if he, and he can throw a frag grenade, which is basically your lethal from COD. His ultimate is a barrage, which is very, very good, and it calls down an artillery strike within an area. It's very useful. Now, how does he play? Okay, I'm going to explain this right now. With Victor, I like to use burst mode. There are no other viable options in my opinion. Shrapnel is okay, but it's a very odd build and I do not like it. I find burst mode to be the most accurate and to have a very good TDK. TDK is time to kill and time to kill is what you want to maximize. Now, the build that I have is called Asian Test B because I'm Asian, sorry, this should be actually certified because we already finished the testing. Um, and it stands for Asian Certified Burst Mode. Okay, I always use the letter of the talent that I pick. Flak Jacket increases your maximum health by 200. This may not seem like much, but considering how squishy he is, this can be the difference between life and death for you. That's why I like having hit point increases. If you don't like this, you can drop this to about 100. I recommend 100 because it can save you from some ults, so 100 would be the minimum. You can dump it into XL Mag if you really want to. This is another way to play. Um, the other thing is that you can always add to Predator as well, granting you up to 25% lifesteal. That's another viable option. Firing Stance is usually just uh, a throwaway card, and Compensator is another key card in this build. You need it at 5. Why? Re eliminating all recoil when using your ADS is very, very good for your aim. Eliminate all recoil, and basically you have a laser instead. That's what you want with this guy. You don't want recoil, you don't want flinch. You will still have flinch from being shot, but recoil completely eliminated, that's very good. Okay, so overall what this is designed to do is to maximize your ability to aim down sights and use your burst mode. We're going to demonstrate that now. Smoochie, would you kindly cue us for a match? Yes, sir. Oh, I get called sir now? Huh. Pretty I'm cool. being polite. You're older than me. <laughs> <laughs> and instantly my pride as a, as a man was wounded for I am older now. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. All right, so... Um, Irrespective of the team that's here, we're going to insta-lock Victor because um, one thing which you'll realize is that uh, much like with my Dauntless videos, and some of you may know me from my Dauntless videos, I do not, I do not, um, I do not ever edit my videos, nor do I, nor do I like, uh, you know, do the thing whereby like I'll chop, change, stuff like that. We tend to show you the whole unedited footage, that way you know we're not sneakily changing talents or things like that. And once again, we will go through the talents one more time. When I'm in there, I'm also going to show you what items to buy. And when we do that, we're going to remove my webcam temporarily so you can get a full view. Our map currently is Timbermill. It's going to be an interesting one. All right, let's 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 see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. All right, depends on what the enemy has, but let's hope our flankers can handle this. They're going to need some... Oh, boy. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm a flanker. Ah, uh, okay. So if we die, I will blame you. Now, the enemies don't have a healer, so as long as we eliminate them, we should be fine. I'll be playing a bit more defensively. They also don't have a sniper, which is very good for us. All right. So this might be a bit of a scuffed match, but you're about to see how Victor does his thing. Okay. All right. Here's my weapon. I'm but I'm still here. Okay. Asian nerd. Mask ready for up, you. Everyone. All right. Burst mode talent, ASEAN certified B. These are the skills in case you didn't get to catch them earlier. Make sure you screenshot them now. This is what you need in your build. All right, Compensator 5, Firing Stance 1, Predator 4, XL Mag 3, Flak Jacket 2. Or you can have Flak Jacket 4 and XL Mag 2. Either way, it works. Okay, for Victor, I will usually buy for him Life Rip. That is a first standard. And Morale Boost. Why? You want his ult up as much as possible. It's very good for you. So as you can see, with you, when you eliminate all recall with ADS, it's a fucking laser. Alright, so this is what you want. I'm going to put my webcam back now. Alright. You will use your laser to basically, like, laser your opponents into, into, into submission. But because they are all healing, all da uh, no healing, all damage, we are going to play very defensively. Alright, so that's going to happen right now. 
Here we go. I'm going to go up to the sniper spot because they don't have a sniper themselves. They do have dredge, but dredge is, you know, dredgeful. Heh, <laughs> heh, terrible joke. Hey. Okay. So you can basically, like, think of it as playing COD, realistically speaking. You're just going to laser anyone that comes up against you, all right? Um, our tank is not on point yet, but that's okay. There we go. And this is going to be a bit of an easier match than, than we uh, might normally have, because honestly, there is very little effort required. Uh, anyone, anyone in trouble on point? Are we all good on point? Okay, we are good on point. So now I'm, I'm running to reposition. This will, this will often be a good choice because it also gives me time to trigger my healing and I can snipe them from a high position. Now it doesn't matter even if he billows because what's he gonna do? Okay, so our tank has literally gone off. I'm going to try and push the payload a little bit. And as I see an enemy, basically, my role is sniper. This is what this build is designed for. It makes Victor a very, very huge long-range threat. He suffers a bit in short range, especially with the lower... Um, especially with the lower total hit point count. But... His long range damage is nothing to nothing to sneeze at, and honestly he can dish out plenty. There you go, you can eliminate people that way. Oh damn, Dredge got me. Blew me up. Okay, some Haven and more Life Rip. Life Rip is generally what you want to max first. If you find reloads to be a problem, you can you can get Deft Hands, but I like to have my defensive items up first. So Life Rip, Haven, standard. Morale boost will be the, the next thing I work on. But again, it all really depends on how these guys do their thing. So I'm gonna I'm gonna take a high position first. So these guys are all doing their thing. They're all dangerous and deadly. I'm going around them. Okay, their dredge is dead. Oh, damn, Zin got me. So, um, sorry, uh, Spoochie, can you come and flank around the side? Yep, I'm alone right now. Oh no, everyone's everyone's there, but like, okay. Um, when you're when you're flanking, right, you want to go all the way around the buildings to hit them from the back line completely. Do that, you'll be all good. Okay, that's it, that's it. I'm coming your way as well. Got their Koga. Damn. Zin got me. Engaging, engaging the flanks at close range will use a result in your death, so try not to do that. Okay. Push fail, but that's alright. <laughs> Our IO hasn't even bought items. That is fantastic. Now, I swear to God, if they lose this, they are going to be the shame of everything. <laughs> I don't think they will lose, but you know, very hard to trust randos these days. All right, let's hope they know what they're doing. I will do my best to support them. So at long range, I have an advantage and that will always be very, very clear with Victor.
Oh, is dead. So being a damage dealer, you want to be clever. Don't don't ever uh, do silly things like you know, just getting into combat for the sake of combat. Be intelligent about where you're gonna move, how you're gonna move, and you know if the enemy's all up somewhere, you know reposition. That is literally what your job is. You know, don't be afraid to alt somebody like right right up to start. Oh shh. I'm taking the point, so we capture. Okay, we have the payload again. Lethal out. Cerebral Okay, as you can see, range is your is your friend. No, Ray's dead. Ah. Okay, attack. Ah, yeah, somebody avenged you already. It's good. Sure, Koga. Ivy, you nerd. Damn, Dredge got me. He knew where I was running, little punk. Okay, Haven and maxed out life rip. As you can see, the way that I'm playing is I'm constantly trying to seek the best position to snipe from, and I will use that to my advantage. Now, of course, the map the map matters, like what kind of map you've got, and stuff like that. These are little, little things that change, but... Um, you, in general, want to always be in a position of strength. Behind us? Yep. I'm behind them. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I was trying to go up to that building to snipe him. Now let me shoot Why my is teammate. someone not buying any items? Mm, because they are nerds. <laughs> they are probably very, very new. Kaz, how's your Neverwinter going? <laughs> Meh. Meh. My wife yeah, is not so in good health today. <laughs> so she is in meh mode. Yeah, right, I'm gonna go to bed. Yeah, I'm gonna go to bed. What? Four, yeah, me too, too, too so. What? <laughs> and, yeah, I'm sorry. I hope it feels better soon, honey. Mm. Bye, we shall miss you. Oh, I miss you too. Uh, I will bye. send you texts immediately after this video is finished. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Whoa, they all went to my side, like, bro, calm down. Oh my. Yep, they're getting better. It hurts a lot. Yep. But <laughs> that is what you gotta deal with. Let's play another round. They know effectively what you guys are gonna do and what you guys want to do, so they're gonna hit you hard. One more. Hello. Hi. Hey. Who's that? Oh, Amaticus. What's up, man? I'm shooting a video, bro. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, that's okay. Now you can. Um, well. No, 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 still working. Kaz, I'm just Kaz, in the short break. 
Kaz ditched us, but you know, <laughs> she's not well today. Yeah, I'm so. just in a short break, bro. No. Work stressing, stressing me out, bro. bro. <laughs> okay, so in this sort of situation, this is generally the type of situation that happens once the um, the main team gets way too confident, like because they think, oh, they don't have a healer, so you know, we can go all in. But these guys are out playing because they know the flank routes, they know where to go. So they're they're keeping very safe from my snipes. And that's And I do not know where to go. Yep. There's a lot of places on top of buildings and stuff like that. that you can... Yeah, I'm trying to get out of that. Yeah, so you gotta use your combat slide. Trying to kill him oh my god, I got him. Yeah, I got killed though. Damn. You got the dredge, nice. Yeah, also we have a, a very, very odd uh, ROM who doesn't really do tanking on um, points. So that, that's another thing that's problematic, I would say. Shit! The healers are not healing me! Yeah. Oh man, we actually lost this one. That's crazy. That was a shameful defeat. But anyway, you can see the strength of Victor in the first uh, two two rounds, where um, realistically the odd playstyle of the team. Now, I I honestly don't know what to do with them, but there is no way that one person can carry by themselves. But you can see clearly that despite not touching the point much, um, my stats are miles better than the whole team. Sorry, Smoochie. Um But yes, this this in general okay. is what you will achieve when you follow that Victor build. So. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. We hope that it helps you play a better Victor. Okay, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. You can drop a tip via the link in the description of the video if you want to support my channel. You can also join as a channel member and gain access to various smirks, such smirks, perks, such as talking to Smoochie. Or, and, um, what's the last one? Oh yeah, you can send super thanks on YouTube. Thank you very much. And also, uh, since it is currently a new month, we do not yet have a February's top supporter list, but... We do want to thank our top tier members, Puni Puni, OnlyFans, Zack NFG Prestige, Nate the Great Prestige, The Forgotten Prestige, Night Ranger X Prestige, Mashari El Shahari Prestige, Titorius Venom Prestige, King Prestige, Pinomies Prestiged. And of course, thank you for viewing this. And thank you, Smoochie, and of course, Kaz, who's no longer here, and Amanicus for accompanying me for this. Quick, Smoochie, say the thing. Um, Pop Champ. <laughs> Gets y'all in the next.